Tonight, a community comes together to help a church after this week's devastating tornado. Fox 30's Ben Lockridge has more on the show of support in Collinsville, plus what it will take to bring back First Baptist. It's day two since a devastating storm left the community of Collinsville assessing damage and beginning the cleanup process. First Baptist Church of Collinsville spent most of the day dealing with insurance assessments and planning for future church services. Pastor Wade Rick says that he is thankful for all the support and help, but asks that individuals take great care when they come out to aid them. We ask you, please don't go in the buildings. Uh, the buildings are unsafe right now, uh, so uh, I think we're going to get those boarded up so people can't go in. Uh, but um, and don't walk amongst the rubble. It is uh, it's very unsafe. Meanwhile, Rick says that today was the first day since the storm he was able to do his primary job. Well, today for me, uh, I'm getting the opportunity to minister to my, my church family. Uh, we've had about six people hit. Um, we, my wife and I went visiting today just to check on them and pray with them. Um, it's, it's really more about what's going on in the community and with people. There's been several that they're actually their roofs were raised up off their house and sat back down. So um, they're all waiting on insurance adjusters to this afternoon and uh, um, just really worried about what, what that means for them. Ricks added that though it's been a difficult and trying time for his church, he's already seen God work and looks forward to what he has in store for the future. I expect God to do some pretty cool things and uh, um, I've had several pastors call me and encourage me, uh, T.J. Jennings from Pine Forest and Danny Lanier from Northcrest have both talked to me this morning and encouraged me that God's got great things for us and he, this is when he has an opportunity to work the, the greatest things, you know, so uh, certainly we expect a year from now we're not going to be the same community and we're not going to be the same church that we were. we're I, I think we're going to be a, a better community and better church. The greatest miracle Rick says he's seen is the joining of the community. And we had people yesterday uh, from all over, different denominational uh, people, people that may not even go to church anywhere. They were here just saying, where can we help? And they were working so hard. Uh, clearing and getting things done. While the congregation of First Baptist Church figures out what to do next, Pastor Rick says that they will be meeting at Pine Forest Baptist Church this Sunday at 2 p.m. In Collinsville, Ben Lockridge, Fox 30 News.